Yeah, that's been a couple of years in the making and tonight Royal Oaks finally moving forward to renovate the old Normandy Oaks golf course. Yeah, 7 Action News reporter Matthew Smith is there live right now. Matt, what does that uh, 40 acre site look like right now? Uh, a lot different the last time you grabbed a set of clubs and slung them over your back to take a whack. You know, you got back in the distance here, these trees that have been cut down, logged. Uh, you can notice here as we walk around where the clubhouse used to be, no more fence. And hey, mention those trees. You got the big wood chip pile. A lot of uh, debris out here for people to pick up and take as if they're going to do some mulching. But one of the things they're going to be doing tonight is looking at five different plans to figure out what they can do moving forward with all this so they can turn that golf course into the city's largest park. The city of Royal Oak has five options in front of it, each different, each looking to turn this one-time golf course into a place for families and the community to gather. Dormant for some two years, the course is hardly recognizable. The fairway's long gone, hazards now logged, and in some cases mulched. The challenge is that in order to turn this into something fantastic, the city will need to choose an architect without an official plan, as the goal is for whoever they hire to oversee the entire project would actually be formulating a plan by working with the residents. Now that also means the final cost is not known at this time, but whoever gets this deal, any of those five developers, they will be working directly with those residents to figure this all out. The meeting is tonight. I'm putting information up on our website, WXYZ.com, right now. We're live in Royal Oak this morning. Matthew Smith, 7 Action News.